a fan. I would. <laughs> One of my Chanel's selling the bin. Chanel, seriously. That's what you like about You've got one job. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is going to be a sheen haul, a bikini haul. I'm trialling this setup, but I don't know if I like it, so <laughs> we'll see at the end of the video. This video is not sponsored, obviously, by sheen. I wish it was, because I love sheen. I could be on there all day scrolling through, buying everything. I went shopping at sheen, and I bought stuff. Sheen, Shein, Shine, who really knows, is one of my favourite brands. I'm going to be completely honest with you all. I did do a shop on Shein, Shein, Shine, and I did get a few, a couple of bikinis, but some of the stuff I'm going to show you I've already had, but most, if not all of them, I bought this summer, and they are still on the website. So I'm going to include them because I literally only bought like two recently, and I have not got the money to go out and buy like 20 swimwears because I'm an unemployed recently graduated student so if you, any of you have been students you know how bad the money situation can get so I couldn't afford to go and buy like a hundred pounds worth of sheen stuff so I'm basically just doing a haul of like a lot of sheen stuff that I already had I will leave links to them below but if any of you shop on sheen, sheen, I say sheen, you should, you would know that like there's so many pages of stuff that it's hard to find what you bought again. Well, I guess I can go on my order history. Whatever. I'll try and link as many as I can below. <laughs> on to the haul. So I did do videos prior that I'm going to include here in like a little thing while I talk about the bikini. If I'm sweaty in it, please just like ignore because honestly, I don't know how sweaty I've got trying on bikinis. But yeah, I was a bit sweaty, so ignore that. On to the first bikini. I'll start with one I already had, um, and I love this bikini. It is a little pink bikini, little bikini top. It's The straps are adjustable, which is always good, because then your boobies can always fit in it. And the bottoms are just like, I like, I quite like these bottoms. They're not my favourites, but they're not bad, because they're, they're not like thong. They don't like show everything in the back but they like they show enough and yeah they're really cute they're like this not string they're just like there i do really like this bikini i think it's really cute the color's great it makes me feel quite brown which is good not my favorite of the lot but it's a reliable bikini like if i was going anywhere i could easily wear this i'd feel quite confident in it love oh this is gonna annoy me that this side of my face is really dark i know i'm gonna look through and edit and be like idiot your face is dark but whatever next bikini let's go with one i bought i bought this little swimsuit slash bikini in i think it was a, the three piece section basically this little white ribbed like kind of string but it's only got the tie up at the back and these are like adjustable really cute the reason i got this is because on the picture it comes it shows like a swimsuit and the top so it's like half swimsuit half bikini top and i thought to myself i thought well if it's a three piece it must give you bottoms as well so i thought i could get more for my money and have a swimsuit and a bikini this is the swimsuit for obviously as you can see you can't wear this on its own because your boobies would be out unless that's your thing then go for it Personally, I wouldn't wear this on my own because on its own because my boobs would be out and I haven't really got boobies to be showing off. So if you've got big boobies, go for your life. But I just don't have those. It comes with these bottoms and I don't like these. I hate these bikini bottoms. They make, I don't know what it is, but it, in bikinis, if they come really high up your back at the back, it makes your bum look quite flat. Personally, that's what I find. Like certain things make it look not so good. Not that it looks that great, but you know what I mean. So it comes with this bottoms top to go and then the swimsuit. I was happy with the fact that I could wear it as both, but I, I never wear these bottoms. I just don't like them. Love this. Obviously, you've seen the video I put on with it. But the swimsuit, I will say, is it, it gathers in a weird place. Like, when you put it on, it like gathers down by your lower belly and it doesn't quite sit right. That's just my personal experience with it, but... It's a really cool design, but yeah, it just doesn't quite sit right on me, but I think it's just different body shapes will sit different in different people. So 
yeah, it is really cute. So if you want a cool, like if you're going to a, beat, a pool party and you want like a bit of a cool kind of vibe, then it's kind of a, it's a good kind of thing for that. But I would have probably wear it like going to the beach because it's just a bit bitty. The next one I'm going to show you is my favourite one of them all. And I've had this, I had this before this, this um, recent order, but it's this blue and red or pink bikini and it's so cute again i got this in the three piece section and um, because it comes with a little skirt these bottoms are good actually they probably are my favorites um kind of bottoms because they're like they cover enough in front and back and they they give my bum a nice shape because just they frame it quite nicely this top is my favorite one to sunbathe in because of the style it's really comfy it like gives you nice tan lines also because it doesn't tie up around the neck i find with halter necks that it hurts my neck like it really pressures down on my neck after a while because obviously you want to tie it quite tight so that your boobs lift it up i mean for me personally i need that i like this because it does that because you can tighten these really tight and it lifts it but it doesn't like hurt your neck and give you a bit of a headache so i love this top it's my favorite kind of bikini top ever and it comes with this little skirt which is like it's like elastic it's a sarong. I never know how you're supposed to wear this. But if I wear it on my waist, I feel like it, it makes me give me a nice shape from the front, but then from the back, there's no point because it literally doesn't cover my bum whatsoever. But then on my hips, I feel like it doesn't look as good from the front, but it covers my bum at the back. But it is a really cute set. It's my favourite set. Um, and I would fully recommend this one. And every, every time I've worn it, everyone has been like, I love that bikini on you. So yeah, I love this bikini. This bikini, I'm going to do um, the other one I bought in the recent order which is this orange one, orange and blue, and you tie this around your neck, like, crisscross. Now, I will say that I did get this in a recent order, but I have tried it on, um, and I took out the, like, pads that came in the boobies, because I thought, without those, it would... I was expecting it to give me a low-key boob job when I put it on, because the girl in the picture, she obviously had double Ds, idiot. But I thought, her boobs are huge, and the way she... You know when you tie something and it, like, pulls them in and up? I thought it would do that but it doesn't <laughs> but it is really cute it's a cute like style if you've got boobs oh my god this would look so good on you and i like the bottoms they're quite they're quite flattering so it's a lovely very nice bikini but it just didn't suit me so yeah this one i've had again i've had it since the beginning of summer i think it's an orange bikini orange makes you look really brown so i love orange bikinis these bottoms are actually probably the most flattering out of every single one i've shown you because they like they've got this like little v shape at like in the front and back and it kind of gives you that nice shape if you get what i'm saying this bikini top it's nice and i do like it i like the concept of it if you're going for an under boob look this is a vibe but like obviously in my videos i don't wear under boob on camera because it'd be a bit much so if you wear it under boob it's a really cool bikini but without that for me I look like a 12 year old boy at the top because I haven't, like I said a million times, I'll say it again, I don't have any boobs. If, you're, if you've got small boobs like me, it's cool for an under boob look. But if you don't like the under boob look, then I wouldn't recommend it. But saying that, this is such a cute bikini and I would definitely wear it out. It's great, I would wear them all out, like I love them all. I love this, I do love it, but yeah, not as flattering as the rest. The last bikini I'm going to show you is this red bikini. It's like, I don't know what it's called when they like gather. And you like wear it like gathers in the middle this red top which is really cute if you like thong um bikini then go for your life these are really nice they are very flattering i will say but yeah they are thong so if you don't like thong then don't go for this style and then this top is really nice it's um very frilly um very nice it's a very nice set for like a pool party because it's like dressy i'd say but it's not like too much yeah it's not an everyday bikini but it's definitely a more dressy kind of vibe bikini and yeah recommend all the bikinis i've shown you are in small that concludes my bikini haul whoa did you hear that grind it till you find it is that is that the right is that right okay grind it till you find it on the gear stick i really can't give you like a million bikinis but i thought it gave a good round of all the styles that they offer in Sheen, Shine, Shein. But that's my bikini haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know any other videos you want to see. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in another video.